Where you at, brother? Good morning. Uh, Good morning. I'm uh, about uh, 15 minutes away. Okay, gotcha. All right, well, then we will see you here shortly, sir. Bah! All right, so we just got packed up for, we're heading to shoot today. Shoots. We're going out to Alliance, Barber, or, uh, oh, Barber Airport <laughs> in Alliance, <laughs> um, which is where Josh keeps his peat and pole. Yes. And we're shooting a couple episodes. We're waiting on Artem, who's taking forever. <laughs> Dude, he's, he's a bringing a plane that we're going to be doing an episode Ukrainians, on. Ukrainians, man. Those Ukrainians, they'll get you. So we're going to be here about 15 more minutes and we're heading out. We're going to shoot. It's going to be fun. We gotta get we gotta get this plan and go. Let it go. Let it We're go. Here. We're here. Beautiful. At uh, the Deer Park Reservation. So we're at this reservoir. Pretty beautiful. We're going to be shooting a couple things. I think for here, we're going to be shooting the Typhoon H. We shot a segment with uh, the Unique guys, and it went really well, but we wanted to add a little bit more. And what better place than this beautiful reservoir. Hey, man, how's it going? Good, man. How are you? Good. Good to see you. Actually, if you've had a problem with customer service, most likely you've talked to either him or my wonderful wife. Now, you actually have a passion project you're working on, don't you? Yeah, about seven years ago at an auction, I bought a scrapbook from a pilot uh, named Paul Baldwin. Had a couple of pictures, uh, about 100 pictures of 1920s aviation. <laughs> So that was fun. Just got done shooting some segments with the Typhoon. Typhoon H. We did some phantom flying. We're headed to the Barber Airport, which is like five minutes away. Right in the back of Balsam Bees. And we're gonna be shooting a, another episode. Bob Hoover. Tribute to the one and only, the late, great Bob Hoover. All right, let's do it. Love that guy. Christian, you, you literally just took these guys and shrunk them and then did a... That's an otter. That's a... Yeah, it's an otter. <laughs> <laughs> you better watch out. I'm going to hug you again. How are you feeling about this right now? I am bes I'm beside myself. I know. I was, I was excited. I, I was thinking, okay, it's cool. It's going to be like a design. Yeah. This is like... It's no. not a design, it's a whole new this is chapter. A and, and it's by the guys that are, are cutting out our planes every day. Yeah. It just shows that the, just what a special team they are. Yep. Look at all these tiny things you found. Oh. It's like they're putting them <laughs> in a drawer. Mm -hmm. It should be like... It's kind of I love the fact, the so basically, it's kind of like one of those fruit if, if the weight and everything works out properly, that's how small an arrow is. That is a true 30% of the original. <laughs> <laughs> and that's this right here? <laughs> really? The arrow is that much smaller than the spear? The spear is a 50% spear. Oh, okay, 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 gotcha. Christian, how long have you been working on this, man? Uh, Tony and I have been messing around with this for the last month, month and a half. Wow. That's it? That's yeah. incredible. Oh. Dude, you could literally send this in an envelope. I literally, like, watch this, watch this. 
Oh, is that an iPhone 7 in your pocket, or is that yeah. just a mini arrow? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that'd be so, so what, what do you got? Are you trying to put electronics in it? Yeah, so we're, we're going <laughs> to... <laughs> we'll we just like ransacked everything from five years ago, and I think these servers are probably at least five years old. And but they uh, haven't been out of the bag. They haven't been out of the bag, because I think we just got it because we didn't it's know. Time. And, and now time came. we're going to try to make the baby little preemie spear. What, what, what would this be called? Then the, the micro spear? No, what, what's, what's, what's it called when you play darts? Oh, darts? Darts? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so what do you got here? Alright, so this is, by the way, again, this is Christian. And Christian, he works down south in a fulfillment manufacturer, and you drive a lot of different things. You do uh, inventory. Mm -hmm. uh, when things come in, you inventory, you catalog it, and then outgoing, things mm -hmm. like that, right? But in the meantime, also, they've been secretly pioneering um, shrinking our foam <laughs> down and working with Adams, and he just like blew this bomb up in the northern location today. And yeah, all of our minds are blown. Yeah, yeah we, like, we're done. I can't even work. It's, it's like no one's working right now. We're just looking at this awesome little kind of sphere. Yeah, and so basically what, he, what what happened here was they worked with Adams and they scaled the foam down by how much? How much did you scale down by? It's, uh, 30 to 50 percent of the original size. So and then you just took the plans and scaled it down accordingly? Yeah. It's crazy. It's not like 50 percent lighter, yeah. but it's really strong. So yeah, I didn't glue the servos down. I don't know if it's in the fly or not, but this is basically, we had like this crashed uh, air core, power core. From the old uh, so, Miss America. Yeah, matter of fact, this one, if you look at this one servo, it like goes down a little bit and then comes back up. See that? So, but you know, up up and left and right are really all that's important, right? All right, you ready to do this, man? Yep. Awesome. Yeah. So we're working on a drum metal. We have a drum metal yeah. transmitter. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Running a Hobbyco power core brick. Oh no, it's raining. But we have water resistant foam. Water resistant foam! <laughs> Alright, fly Don't blow right. it, if this works. If it works, absolutely. Alright, full throttle. Ooh, 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 not bad, not bad. It's a high tech <laughs> transmitter you have there. I know, it's, you know, I don't want to bring any drama into this situation, so. <laughs> it's little servos, I just want to pinch their little cheeks. <laughs> they don't have cheeks, they're servos. You pinch your little servo you can, cheeks. You can grab them by the little arms though and wiggle them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Alright, let's like try that, it again. Man. Yeah, you got power? Yeah. This resolution on this transmitter is terrible. Right? Oh, Feel good about it. Yeah. Yes! <laughs> oh, 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 oh! All right, yes. that's landed. That's basically because we don't have a good radio. <laughs> and I'm a terrible pilot. <laughs> yeah, that's like, here's the resolution. Here's me moving it. There's the first. Get the, uh, a new battery in it. All right, you guys ready? We are ready. Do you, do you want you want to launch it? I'm gonna video tape this. You ready? <laughs> Be gone. That's it. Woo flourish, flourish your wings and fly. <laughs> Let it fly. Ha! <laughs> that was it. It was just the resolution of the radio. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was cool. Do circles around me. In between the two guys. Ooh. You guys are jerks! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Boom! High five, dude. That was awesome. It's exciting, dude. You literally just like created a whole new era. <laughs> like this is the birth of something new. The micro mini power airplanes. You just birthed that plane. Airplanes. Airplanes. Just birthed that plane. Yeah. Christian and Tony have birthed. <laughs> Have birthed something beautiful. <laughs> They've birthed airplanes. <laughs> All right, let's put a new thing in.
this. Yeah, big, small. Big, small. Big, small.